Hi everyone, my name is Ryan. I'm with Stalls and Stalls Transfer Express. Today we're going to be talking about ways to maximize profits when you have multiple customers that need multiple full color prints using our ultra color soft transfers. Uh, the beautiful thing about this is you're able to do 11 and a half by 18 inches for a gang sheet. I'm able to get, in this example, seven different company logos. Uh, I have the same thing over here with seven different company logos. And this one as well had about four or five different company logos. So you can maximize the space with your gang sheet options. Uh, so in some cases, uh, the Ultra Color Soft makes more sense than our Ultra Color Max. And that would be really based on the quantities. So in this example, I'm going to be showing you how to do uh, three different garments for the fitness apparel industry with um, Basically, it only came out to about uh, 64 cents per image because I ordered a hundred of these sheets at four dollars and fifty cents for the large quantity that my customers demand. So come on over to the heat press. We'll show you more. All right. So we're going to be using the Hotronics Auto Open Clam with a six by ten interchangeable lower platen. And the reason I chose this one is it's isolating the print location and it's also allowing the seams and the hood of this short sleeve hoodie to actually fall off allowing the perfect print location and uh, print area here. So I'm going to go ahead and slide this on. And the important thing to remember about Ultra Color Soft, unlike Ultra Color Max, is you are not able to use pillows. You do need a firm pressure here. So what we're going to do here, we have our settings for the uh, 290 degrees for 15 seconds. We are going to do a five second pre-press here, take out any moisture or wrinkles that might be in the garment. All right, and I do need a cover sheet for this, so I'm going to go ahead and put my print on. Nice thing is it's already centered for me, because I went ahead and went just a few inches up there. And the cover sheet's important because it actually prevents the, uh, this is a cold peel, so you want to make sure that it doesn't prematurely get released from the carrier, and that's why we're using this as a static guard for the, uh, for the platen here. All right, and we're going to leave this carrier on because this is a cold peel. So I'm going to set this aside. We're going to do some other uh, prints and we'll come back to this one a little bit later. Okay, so the next item up is going to be this, this Ogeo bag. And what I'm going to, going to use the six by 10 platen here, allowing me to thread on with the wonderful thing about the Hotronics Auto Open Clam is I have all this space for printing. But you can see here, I want to get the print right here on this pocket. So what I'm going to do is actually put a print perfect pad on the inside here. It's perfectly cut out. I'm just going to go ahead and slide that in. And what that print perfect pad does, it allows me to, it elevates the seams here. So I'm not going to actually press down onto any of this material as I press down. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do a real quick pre-press just for a few seconds here. And I'm going to need to adjust my pressure quite a bit here because again we have the smaller platen and we do have this print perfect pad on the inside. Let's make sure our pressure is good. There we go. So we got our nice pressure, nice little press. And then we're going to be taking our customer's logo here, just placing it right on the front. And again we do need a cover sheet for this because this is a cold peel application here. All right, so we're going to lock it down for 15 seconds at a pressure of about a four because again, we're elevating it and we're using the print perfect pad. Okay, so again, with it being a cold peel, we're not going to be peeling it right away. We're going to be taking this off. Just make sure we get all our tags and everything so it doesn't get stuck. And we're going to set this aside and come back to this in a little bit. And now the next one we're going to be doing is our uh, pair of yoga pants or little uh, leggings rather. So I'm going to be using the double sleeve and leg platen for this. We're going to lock that in place there. All right. So now we're going to go ahead and stick on our OGO leggings. Nice thing about this, if I wanted to, I could actually be doing double the print. I could do one here and one over here at the same time, which is great about this double leg and sleeve platen. 
All right, so I'm going to be putting the design right about by the seam here. Let's make sure that that, and what I do want to do is make sure the cover sheet does protect this just in case. Okay, we're going to do a uh, pre-press and we may have to do some pressure adjustments here because again, we just switched out platens. But the beautiful thing about Hotronics Auto Open Clam is it's really easy to adjust. Now we're at about a six, which is, that's pretty good. All right, so now that we have that, go ahead and put our design here right down the seam for the Iron Forge Gym. Just gonna go ahead and put our cover sheet and we'll go long this way just to protect that logo just in case here. All right, and this again is a 15 second press, medium to firm pressure, a level six on a Hotronics auto open clam. And again, because it is a cold peel, we are gonna set it aside and come back to it later. There we go, slide our leggings off, and we will come back here when everything's cooled down. All right, so now that our transfers have cooled down, we're gonna go ahead and do the cold peel. We'll start here at the corner. And I'm just gonna go ahead and peel that off on a diagonal motion. And there you have it, came out great. All right, next up is our bag. Again, we're gonna start at the corner and just do our cold peel, comes right off the carrier. And our last piece in the collection here is our leggings. And again, we've let this cool down, we're just gonna do our cold peel. Start at a corner here. There you have it. All right, so as you can see, we maximized our profits using Ultra Color Soft in this example. I was able to go ahead and order a gang sheet, 11 and a half by 18 inches. I was able to put multiple company logos on here with different shades, grades, uh, gradients, and all kinds of different colors. So in my example here, I was able to print 100 bags, 100 pair of leggings, and 100 tops. They came out to 64 cents per image. And the reason why is when I bought the quantity of 100 at Stahl's Transfer Express for the Ultra Color Soft, came out to $4.50 per transfer sheet. So again, you're able to maximize your profits with this wonderful Ultra Color product. Uh, so thank you for watching today. Please subscribe to us and join us on our social media pages. We appreciate you choosing Stahl's.